Today we have a Microsoft Surface Touch Cover that we're going to unbox and then connect with our Surface RT tablet here. So let's go ahead and unbox it. So let's take it out of the packaging here. And here's a look at the packaging. You can see this is a Surface Touch Cover designed for Surface Windows 8 Pro and Windows RT. So we'll take this out of the packaging, remove this tape there, and then slide out the touch cover. And then we'll just press on the back here and that should release it. So this is a touch cover, not a type cover. The type cover has actual buttons with action on them. These don't have actual action on them. You can see it's just raised slightly and there's no actual action to the buttons, but it's a nice cover, pretty sturdy. It's got a little trackpad here. Let's see what else is in the box. Slide this out. I believe that's all that's in there. All right. And here looks to be probably instructions. So touch and type cover warranty information there. Then here are the instructions, which you simply just click it together and uh, power it on. So next we'll connect our surface to our touch cover. Here's our surface RT. And down here on the bottom, you can see where exactly you connect this touch cover to. And our surface is powered off right now as well. So to connect the touch cover to the surface, it's real simple. Simply click it on. And you heard that click there. That means we are connected. There we are. We can fold it up so we have a nice cover for the screen. Makes it real easy to carry around. All right, so now we'll flip out the kickstand here. All right, and then set it up. Now we will power on our Surface RT. And you can see right here that we are installing a system update. I'm guessing that's for the touch cover. So we'll let that install and then take a look at how this touch cover works real quick. Now we have booted up, so I just need to log in. All right, we're back. I had a bit of a problem with the touch cover not actually working. I had the trackpad working, so the mouse would move around. As you can see there, the mouse is moving. And I could get the volume to work, but none of the keys actually worked. So of course I searched for updates, but there were no more updates. And then I did some messing around here in Device Manager. I couldn't get the correct driver to install for our touchpad here. So then I ended up having to come to update and recovery and do a refresh your PC. For some reason, that was the only way we could actually get the touch cover to work. So after doing the refresh, now everything works as it should. So if you're having problems with the keyboard not working on your touch cover, then you may want to try a refresh. So now just to quickly show that it does work, I'll just start typing. I'll hit N O T and all of a sudden it comes up notepad for us. So I'll select notepad. And now notepads open and you'll notice if I type, everything responds as it should. And there's actually a little like keyboard, a key clicking noise whenever we type. So hopefully you can hear that. I'll zoom in so you can see that we're actually getting a response here, hitting the J key, U. All right, so there we go. Also our trackpad works just fine. You'll see here I can move around I can use this button here to close, or I could just tap right on the uh, trackpad itself. So I don't want to save that. A touch cover or type cover is a must have accessory for your Windows Surface tablet. <laughs>